Welcome back. Today, we're going to be learning about plant body systems. So stay tuned and let's get ready to learn. What are the body systems of a plant? Plants can be divided into two body systems, the root system and the shoot system. The root system includes the plant's underground roots. On the other hand, the shoot system includes the above ground stems, leaves, and flowers. Tube-shaped tissues called xylem and phloem connect the two systems. Xylem and phloem are vascular tissues because they serve as canals for transporting materials through a plant. Xylem transports water and minerals. Phloem transports sugar. Tiny root hairs growing out from roots absorb water and dissolve minerals from the soil. These substances pass into xylem tissue in the roots and are carried to the rest of the plant. Roots also help support and anchor the plant in the soil. Some roots store extra sugar that is made in the leaf during photosynthesis. Stems connect roots to leaves. Stems also contain vascular tissue. Water minerals move upward in the xylem from the roots to the rest of the plant. Phloem carries the sugar made in the leaves during photosynthesis to the roots and the rest of the plant. Stems also hold the plant upright so that leaves can reach sunlight. Some stems store water or sugar until it is needed by the plant. Leaves make food for the plant. During photosynthesis, carbon dioxide from the air and water from the soil are converted to sugar and oxygen. Carbon dioxide enters and oxygen exits a leaf through tiny holes called stomata. Here's a diagram of stomata. The xylem in a leaf delivers water and the phloem carries away sugar. So again, xylem in a leaf delivers water, phloem carries away sugar. Thank you for watching this video. Uh, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and yeah, stay tuned for lesson 10. Until next time, peace out.